What's up guys, I'm Lee Williamson and today I'm going to show you three tips on how to make one object have the same positional values as another object inside of Cinema 4D. So without further ado, let's dig in. Right, so I am going to show you three methods on how to parent one object to another to gain the same positional values. So let me show you how it's done. So if we were going to move this roll off this plate and the sausage off this plate and this ketchup off this plate. Now we want to, um, let's say, bring that roll down to the same place as, as the plate itself. So we can pick up that roll and drop it underneath there. So it's a child of the plate. And then we can go into our coordinates and we can press zero, zero, zero and apply. And it should pop to the plate. Now, the first thing you're going to notice is that it pops to the plate, but it pops kind of through the plate. So what you should make sure that you do is if you look at the plate itself, uh, well, the roll, it's uh, axis point is in the center of the uh, hot dog itself, the hot dog roll. So if you go to your axis, um, what do you call that thing? Enable axis, you drag it down to the very bottom, like that, and you turn it off. Now let's give it another try. Let's press zero on there and apply, and boom. Now it's floating above the plate. So what have we done wrong? So we do the same thing with a plate, is we want the bottom of the plate to be where the roll lands on. So we go back to our enable axis and we bring that down to the bottom of the plate because that's where that roll is supposed to be. Click off it and now I click on the roll again and let's press zero again and apply and boom you have it perfectly on the plate so those are the first things to notice that the axis points have to be correct in the right places now if we want to get let's say this uh, sausage to the roll we can do that um, we can use another way we can go to cinema 40 character tags and go to constraint tags. Oh, I've made one extra one by mistake. And we go to attributes and we choose PSR. Now PSR means position scale rotation. So we check that and a new tab appears. And we want that sausage to be on that roll. So we're going to drag the roll down as the target point. And now That has done nothing. Hmm, fantastic. So maybe if I take these out, um, PSR tag, and the rule is the parent. You see, so the sausage is now at the very bottom. Now we want the sausage to be where the roll is. So if we had to put that position scale rotation back on again, that PSR, uh, we can go to the roll itself and we can click on center access to. So what that does is it resets the center axis of the roll itself. So essentially, let's just show you a better idea again. Um, center axis two, boom. And notice the very moment we did that, the sausage went into the roll 
because it was using its central position, the central axis of the roll to connect it there. And we can do the same thing again with the cache up. Now the third method I was going to show you is we can just click on catch up and we can parent it to the sausage and we can just press P reset PSR and boom, it's straight on the sausage. So I would say the FOSSIS method is reset PSR, bearing in mind your access points are in the right positions. Um, if you guys want to know where reset PSR and uh, center access to is you can uh, customize your palette. You go into window customization and you go customize palettes and then you can go P S R and you can drag that to wherever you want. Let me just drag it over here and uh, close it up and then back to customize and save as, and you go and give your palette a name got some more palettes over here and then you should find it under your layout on the right hand side here with the new name that you gave it so i hope you guys found this tutorial useful uh shown you three methods yeah the fastest one is reset psr then you have one where you um you zero out your positions and the third one you use a psr tag which by the way once you have used it and you can just delete it you don't need it but yeah i would recommend the fastest version is reset psr right so i hope you guys found that tutorial helpful if you did please like share and subscribe as i would very much appreciate it and uh stay safe and don't eat too much comforting junk food like that hot dog i just made <laughs> cheers guys bye